Hello dear kids. How are you all? Welcome to Little Riders. And we are celebrating our insects week. And today is day 3. On day 1, we did the bumbly bees. Yes, the honey bees. On day 2, we did the amazing ants amazing ants and now it's day three so which insect are we going to discuss today can you guess it can you guess it yes please say it loudly yes you're right today we are going to discuss about butterflies butterflies can you can you make butterfly with your hands can you please show me yes no i will tell you join your thumbs join your thumbs and move your hands in this way you can make a butterfly so today we are going to discuss about butterflies and caterpillar so we're going to discuss about two insects one is the butterfly who can fly she has the wings and we are also going to discuss about caterpillar who can crawl isn't it interesting yes yes so are you all ready are you all ready yes but before starting our discussion our class I have something very interesting to show to you. Then, ta-da! This is my butterfly. But do you know, I can wear this butterfly in my hands. Yes, I'll show it to you. Isn't it amazing? Isn't it amazing, children? Yes. And do you like to make this butterfly? Do you want to make this butterfly and wear it in your hands? Yeah! It is a really, really fun art and you will enjoy it. Let us first learn how to make this hand butterfly. Yeah! Just go and quickly come back. your mama to make this butterfly for you and also help your mama in pasting the different colors paper okay children so let us start our insects week day three insect which is the caterpillar and the butterfly but first we will discuss what is a caterpillar do you know caterpillar is baby of a butterfly but can you even think that the butterfly has wings to fly the butterfly can fly but caterpillar don't have wings caterpillar cannot fly isn't it an amazing and incredible thing yes that the caterpillar is a baby of butterfly, but caterpillar cannot fly. Yes. Isn't it interesting? So, first let us see what is the life cycle of a butterfly. What happens, children? First of all, there comes eggs. Where are the eggs? Here are the eggs. So first comes the egg. And then... From egg, it becomes a caterpillar, a little tiny caterpillar. The egg 
breaks and there comes a caterpillar and after few days the caterpillar turns into pupa the caterpillar turns into pupa and finally there comes a beautiful butterfly so the life cycle of a butterfly is in four steps yes first comes the egg you all will say with me yeah yeah on number 1 say egg egg number 2 the egg changes into caterpillar number 3 the caterpillar changes into pupa and finally we get a beautiful butterfly yeah isn't it amazing it is a lovely thing children i have some amazing facts to tell you about caterpillar the baby of a butterfly and the butterfly what before studying it let us sing a song will you all sing with me say yes say it loudly yes so 1 2 3 Start one little, two little, three little butterflies, four little, five little, six little butterflies, seven little, eight little, nine little butterflies, ten little butterflies floating through the air. Wasn't it nice? Will you all sing with me again? Now it's your turn, children. Now you are going to sing. One, two. Three. Start. One little, two little, three little butterflies. Four little, five little, six little butterflies. Seven little, eight little, nine little butterflies. Ten little butterflies floating through the air. Who floating through the air? The butterflies are floating through the air. Yes, children. Yes. Now here I have something interesting to tell you about the caterpillar. Earlier I showed you the life cycle of a caterpillar. But do you know children how the caterpillar comes out of a egg? The caterpillar when was inside the egg, the caterpillar starts eating his own egg shells. his own egg shells when the caterpillar was inside the egg the caterpillar starts eating his own egg shells the outer egg shell because the caterpillar is very hungry so the caterpillar starts eating his own egg shells and he comes out and then the caterpillar lives on the leaf when he lives on the leaf He is so hungry that he even starts eating the leaves. The caterpillar eat fruits, flowers, leaves, his own egg shells. And finally, the caterpillar is bigger now. And then the caterpillar hides himself in the leaf. He hides himself in the leaf, and he made a prot. the layer around himself a very 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 fine thread like protective layer around himself and this stage is known as pupa and then finally after few days it changes into butterfly and children there is a very lovely story on my channel known as the very hungry caterpillar It is very interesting you must go and watch I have linked it in the description box Now children I have to show you the body parts of a caterpillar What are the body parts of a caterpillar What we can we see here this is a caterpillar Do we want to learn how to make a caterpillar I will teach you Yes I will teach you in our next video. Just stay tuned for the activity video. But here we can see 
the body parts of a caterpillar. The caterpillar is long, yes. Do you know these two antennas on the caterpillar heads are known as tentacles? Ten to kills. Ten to kills. Yes. And do you know he have see he have so many small small little little legs. So many little little legs. Yes. But the children's front legs are known as true legs. The front legs are known as true black and the back legs are known as pro legs pro legs the front legs are known as true leg and the back legs are known as true leg and this is a head as we all know there is a head there is little eyes yes and then again abdomen where is abdomen the stomach part the stomach part is known as abdomen as we earlier studied in the ants ants also have abdomen yes we all have abdomen do you know where is your abdomen your abdomen is right in your stomach the stomach area is known as abdomen okay so these are the main body parts of a caterpillar head Tentacles, tentacles, he has two tentacles, true legs, prolex, abdomen, abdomen. And the rest of the terms, my dear children, what are they known as? The neck part, the neck part is known as thorax. Where is the neck part of a caterpillar? This area, the neck part is known as thorax, thorax. Isn't it lovely that a caterpillar is so many tiny little little legs but a butterfly can fly in the air. We have body part of a butterfly. Let us see what are the body part of butterfly. The butterfly has eyes. The butterfly has antennas. Now those tentacles of caterpillar changes into antenna. When the caterpillar changes into pupa and then butterfly, those tentacles are known as antenna. Here my hand butterfly is also having antennas. Yes. Yes. So these are known as antennas. Have an, have eyes, two eyes. Now again the neck part is known as thorax. Where is the neck part? This is the thorax this part here is the neck part has been known as thorax we also have a thorax this part of earth is known as thorax and in the butterfly here is the neck and it is known as thorax butterfly has wings has wings 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 and butterfly even has legs where are the legs of the butterfly here these are the legs butterfly has six legs six legs three legs three legs three three legs on the either sides butterfly has six legs yay and abdomen where is the abdomen part this below part is known as abdomen this this bottom part is known as the abdomen again the stomach area is known as abdomen yay so now we even know the body parts of a caterpillar, butterfly, yes. But children, do you know where does the butterfly lives? The butterfly lives in the garden, on the trees. And what does a butterfly eat? Do you know? The butterfly eats fruits and butterfly mainly feeds on the nectar of a flower nectar of a flower the nectar of a flower is so sweet that the butterfly always sit on the colorful flowers yes and children there are so many colorful butterflies all around uh, everywhere white color green color blue color and even the multicolor butterflies yes the butterfly having all colors 
there are so many colors of butterfly all around the world and you can even see some butterflies in your garden area yes butterfly always come and sit on colorful flowers where there is a flower there is a butterfly yeah so you all will go in the morning and see the butterfly and don't forget to tell me don't forget to tell me that you saw a butterfly to click the picture with the butterfly and send it to me yay let us end this video once again with a song on the butterfly but 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 before ending a video don't forget to watch the part two of the butterfly day which will be the activity video Okay, so let us start a song. One little, two little, three little butterflies, four little, five little, six little butterflies, seven little, eight little, nine little butterflies, ten little butterflies floating in the air, floating in the air. Bye bye. And take care. Be safe at home. Bye bye.